Hello everyone. In this video, we will try to learn how to establish a proper perspective for a given angle and degree of an ellipse. So, we have a blank sheet of paper and we will insert or draw a ellipse of any random degree and an angle like so. So, for this degree of an ellipse, how do we know where to place our left vanishing point and our right vanishing point? Well, out of these two, the left vanishing point is very easy because it always lines up with the minor axis of the ellipse. So, if we just draw a line across the minor axis of the ellipse, this goes to the left vanishing point. Fairly simple. The question is, how to draw a line to the right side which goes to the right vanishing point. For this, uh, it's, uh, we shall draw the, the major axis like so. And now we have an intersection point over here. At this intersection point, let us draw a vertical like so. Now, I'll just get rid of this major axis. Now, if I just draw a line like this, which go, which like uh, approximately goes to the right vanishing point, we can see over here at the bottom of the ellipse, uh, where this vertical is dividing the ellipse into say this region, we can see these two halves over here. The goal is to draw this line in such a way that it divides the ellipse into two equal halves, a place where the vertical meets. So this, if I just zoom in here, this is what I mean. This, the place where you are seeing over here, this section and this small section, it should be fairly equal, like so. If you do this properly, this line goes to the right vanishing point. Now, I cannot make this line like this because this section over here is much greater than this section over here. And of course, we can't make it like this because this section over here is way more than this smaller section over here. So the correct way to do is to just get it maybe like so where these two halves appear to be equal like so yes now you can just place the line on the edge of the ellipse and now we have established our right vanishing point and our left vanishing point now if you want to draw a rectangle out of this you can just copy and duplicate this and place it at the top of the ellipse and maybe introduce a little bit of a convergence. That depends on you how much degree of a convergence you want. And yeah, that's it. It is a very simple method of establishing a proper perspective based on the degree of ellipse that you want. All right. Thank you. Thank you so much. I hope you understood.